I'm Councillor Dean Carroll. I'm the Deputy Portfolio Holder for Housing on Shropshire Council. I'm going to talk to you today about um, Shropshire as a home of innovation and, and design and ingenuity. I'm not a local to Shropshire, as you may be able to tell from my accent. And when I first came to Shropshire, all I was told by local people was oh, Shropshire is a graveyard for ambition. Nothing happens in Shropshire. But the truth is, that couldn't be more wrong. The longer I've been in Shropshire, the more I've got to know and appreciate Shropshire, the more I've appreciated how much innovative stuff is happening in, the, in our county today. I've been to some local businesses, for example, Igloo, outside of Craven Arms, who are making some incredible, incredible um, device it's called igloos which if if you're familiar with star trek of old uh, reminds me of the holodeck and i certainly thought that technology like that would never come to pass in my lifetime so so that that's really incredible and shropshire has such a history of delivering at this at this um, kind of stuff i mean Going back 200 years, the, the flax mill, the, the first iron-framed building in the world, the, as it's called, the grandfather of, of skyscrapers. Without it, you'd have no Empire State Building, no Shard, no Canary Wharf. It's a truly revolutionary building. And for the fact that they erected it in a year, that's, it shows what can be done if we put our minds to it. And uh, Charles Darwin, the birthplace of Charles Darwin. Everybody knows Charles Darwin. Worldwide, everybody knows Charles Darwin. He has literally changed the world, changed the way we look at the world. Uh, the theory of evolution, the origin of species. It's absolutely groundbreaking and revolutionary. And these things keep happening in Shropshire. It can't be a coincidence. There's, there's something about Shropshire. And our challenge uh, as a local authority is to create the environment where these things can keep happening so that we can encourage the next generation of Charles Darwin's, the next generation of Abraham Darby's to continue innovating, continue changing the world and what a fantastic place we have to do it from.